Hi, I'm Tim. Welcome to Watch One, and thanks for logging on. Today we're looking at the Hublot Big Bang Ayrton Senna Poudroyant, 44 millimeters in black ceramic. This is one of 500 limited edition units made. Now it honors the memorable, indeed some would say the immortal career of Ayrton Senna, three-time Formula One champion with 65 poles, 41 wins, and 80 podiums that you have to remember he accumulated in only 10 years of driving. Now, there are a lot of memorable F1 drivers, guys who've been called heroes, icons, inspiration to generations of drivers and fans alike, but realistically, Senna's hallmark was his charisma, his force of personality. He compelled the kind of enthusiasm that can't be explained strictly in terms of results. The same kind of love, really adulation, and enduring fame was really never evident for Michael Schumacher or even today for Sebastian Vettel. Despite their surpassing many of Senna's marks, the singular enthusiasm that fans feel to this day for the great man cannot be explained in a Dallas Cowboys, Manchester United, Los Angeles Lakers, New York Yankees kind of rooting for the winner sensibility. Rather, it's all about emotion, passion, and what Senna inspired in those who loved the man, quite frankly. And the bottom line is a lot of that energy is captured in this Ayrton Senna Foudroyant. It's optimistic. It's upbeat. The highlights in terms of color, design, the tributes to Senna, to his institute, to his Brazilian roots, to his career and accomplishments, as well as his mechanical mastery, because quite frankly, it's a Foudroyant split seconds chronograph. This celebrates the best of Senna's memory. And I want to put the watch on the wrist and just give you a sense of how it looks and how it plays in person. Now you can see already that on my wrist, six and a third inches, 16 centimeters in circumference, already you can see that the Brazilian cues and the Senna theme is evident in force throughout this watch. What you can also see is that this watch sits like a low profile tire on an Acura NSX. And for those uh, Acura NSX and Senna fans out there, you know exactly what I mean by that. The bottom line is it's got a sporting, hunkered look to it. It's close coupled to the wrist and it sits quite comfortably. Now on my wrist, again, being only 16 centimeters in circumference, a very big watch, 44 millimeters or larger, simply isn't going to work ergonomically if the designers haven't done their homework. As ever, Hublot's very short lugs and supple natural rubber strap, which will pull down almost straight if you wanted to to fit a smaller wrist, are the key to success. Now the watch is 16 millimeters thick and it does have a bit of a hooked, flared outcropping to it on its flanks, so it's not going to fit under a tight cuff, it's not going to fit under a long sleeve. This is a watch for wearing to the beach, wearing in the pool, this is a watch for enjoying. And with 100 meter water resistance, even though it is a complicated chronograph, you can definitely take it just about any place except diving. Now, I want to call out the quality of this strap and also some of the features in as much as it is part of the style and part of the content of the special edition watch featuring the Brazilian green and yellow highlights as well as the Instituto Ayrton Senna silkscreened logo on the case back. It's got a liveliness to it that really suits the character of a Formula One watch, a tribute watch, a watch that's designed to remember the highlights of a man's life. And of course, the dial speaks to that sensibility. Not just a complicated chronograph, but an explosive, lively, and amusing choice of complications and colorations. The dial has immense life and personality to it with applied diamond polished indices. Each one features yellow luminova as do the hands at center. Now you can see with the split second complication you have continuous chronograph seconds rendered in yellow and again that two-tone yellow and green Brazilian theme for the Rattrapont secondary seconds hand and because the split second chronograph is arguably the ultimate motorsports complication, it allows you to time two simultaneous events while keeping the chronograph running. So for instance, simultaneously, two cars racing around a track, not only are you able to time them precisely, but you're able to continue timing lap after lap to get the gap and get a sense of whether it's increasing or decreasing between competitors. Also useful for yacht racing, your kids track meets, watching the Olympics on TV, or what have you. It's entertaining, and with a foudroyant or flying seconds hand, the entertainment factor is squared. There's a lot going on here. It's a lively watch that's got a real personality, both aesthetically and mechanically. Now, the foudroyant in this watch, it's called Hublot's Caliber HUB44 RTF, and the bottom line is it's based on the foudroyant split-second chronograph developed by Graham and Gerard Perigot, actually developed by Jacquet for them 
during the late 1990s. Now, Jacquet, just to bring us to the present, is now known as La Jupere, but they did a lot of modifications on Valjoux movements. So the caliber HUB 44 RTF is an automatic winding Valjoux 7750 based chronograph movement. This one's distinct from all the others because it does feature both a rattrapant and a split second chronograph. Hacks when you pull the crown for precise time setting. 4 hertz automatic 42 hour power reserve. The real star of the show here is the style of the watch, its dial and its case. And I will emphasize that the case of this watch, being entirely black ceramic, matches the bezel, both rendered in that high-tech kiln-fired material. They keep this watch looking young. Now, although this watch was built in the late 2000s, it looks almost new to this day, precisely because ceramic is virtually as hard as sapphire crystal. So just as sapphire crystal really takes a working over to scratch, the case is just as, as robust. And the nice thing about ceramic is unlike PVD black watches, ceramic is black all the way through. So if you did somehow manage to nick it, scuff it, scratch it, or chip it, there's more black underneath, not metal to gleam out from inside. The texture, the modularity of the construction is a highlight, as it is with all Hublot Big Bangs. You have the case back, you have the bottom portion of the case, the composite insert on the flank here highlighted by the Senna specific Brazilian flag. You have the top of the case. You have the resin bezel gasket insert, the textured bezel right here, and of course the signature Hublot titanium H-shaped bezel bolts. That dial with Senna's signature at 6 o'clock, the flying second clocking one-eighth of a second in increments of one-eighth is a beautiful, lively, energetic, and also quite large feature of the dial. It dominates proceedings in a way that even the split-second mechanism can't challenge. This watch is first and foremost a foudroyant, a rattrapant second, but above all, it is a tribute to Ayrton Senna, his memory, and the sense of wonder that he continues to inspire over two decades after his death. You can see this Hublot Big Bang Ayrton Senna foudroyant, 44 millimeters in black ceramic, on our website, and I have a feeling that if you're into motorsports, if you're a fan of Senna, if you love beautiful and exciting contemporary sports watches, this Hublot Big Bang Ayrton Senna Foudroyant in ceramic, one of 500 made, will be the watch you want.